Hello, dear friends. This is Sister Maria Jo. Presently, I am in the Philippines. I hope all of you are doing well in good health. It is a blessing to have amazing people like you who share with us in this wonderful mission entrusted by the Lord. And so on this beautiful season of Christmas, with joy in our hearts, we wish to greet you and thank you for all that you have done to make another year of our service to the poor a successful one. In the Philippines, usually Christmas songs can be heard and decorations can be seen everywhere when the bird month starts, that is beginning September. Nevertheless, this time, which is nearing Christmas, the atmosphere is a bit gloomy since majority of the places had been damaged by several calamities, flooding, erosions, violence. And prices of food and basic commodities are soaring higher and higher. Losses due to COVID have been not recovered. People suffer, especially the poor, and this is true in the countries where we have our charity programs. Yes, we are in different times. Sisters and children are aware of this, but still our hearts are full of joy and gratitude because you, our dear friends, continue your financial and spiritual support. Your generosity makes our children feel secure and safe. They know that they have enough food to eat and a peaceful home to live and study at our girls' towns and boys' towns. This year, we are able to accept more than 5,000 new children and have graduated almost 4,000. And many of them have found jobs. We continue to feed, clothe, give shelter, and quality education to more than 20,000 poor children. We were able to build the daycare and training centers in Tanzania, a new school building in Honduras. Have started the construction of a new workshop in Charco, and have upgraded the training equipments of our students, and many more improve our service. And our students have responded enthusiastically. Thus, they are much better prepared to face the challenges in life. They know your sacrifices and concern. And together with the sisters, pray for all of you daily. This is the only way we could express our thanksgiving for all that you do for us. We commend to the Lord and our Blessed Mother all your cares. You have made a little Jesus in the poor children under our care happy. May God fill your heart with joy, not only this Christmas, but throughout the new year to come. We love you. And we continue to count on your prayers and support. Together, we can make a difference in the lives of the poor. Merry Christmas and thank you very much. <laughs>